Hello, my name is Amanda Burma. I'm with Frog Logic, and today we'll be going through stepping through a test case line by line in debug mode. With a script, I can set breakpoints and run to those breakpoints from which I can then begin using the test debugging. So my script is now run to a specific step where I set the breakpoint. I can see variables that are available in my script and their values. I can see the application object tree. I can go out and spy objects using the pick tool and see those object properties. I also have access to the Squish script console where I can send commands to the application and see the immediate output, which is often helpful when manually scripting. What we're going to do is use the step into and the step over features of the Squish debugger to be able to step through our script one line at a time. If for any reason you want to continue and resume your script, you're able to resume the script to the end, or you can set another breakpoint, continue stepping through, or resume your script until you reach that next breakpoint. Again, you can step into so that when you have function calls, it will, work, it will walk through those as well or you can step over those function calls and remain at the same level for stepping through your script. Our script resumed and then ran until the next breakpoint. Here I can continue stepping through my script, stepping into the function, stepping over, or resuming or terminating the execution. Thank you for watching this tutorial on working with the Squish script debugger and stepping through scripts. Download your evaluation at froglogic.com evaluate and view other resources at froglogic.com resources as well as the other items listed below.